2019 was a hard year for straight white men. Carson Daly was replaced by Lily Singh. So after such a tough year, I thought, what better idea than to bring back a fan favorite bit, the straight white panel. Unfortunately, it has been impossible to find any straight white men that haven't been canceled yet. Even the titular Chris Gethard couldn't be here tonight because he was just canceled for a series of extremely racist tweets, which I think are still up unless he deleted them already. <laughs> I did find one straight white man who hasn't been canceled. Let's see if we can change that tonight by helping me welcome my friend, Tommy McNamara! All right, now, because we're in such short supply of white men here, Tommy here is gonna have to sit in for each type of white guy. When he sits on this chair, he's sincere. When he sits on, on that chair, he's absurd. And of course, in the final third chair, he's racist. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Tommy. Thank you so much for doing this. Let's get started. You don't want to start in the racist one? OK. Uh, no. <laughs> All right, probably a good call. Tommy, uh, Tommy, you have a new album out now. Uh, mm -hmm. You have an album called uh, Who's Tommy on a Special Thing Records. Yes. That album's not for people like you. <laughs> um, thank you so much for plugging it, Martin. I really appreciate that. You know, it's hard to get press. I really thank you so much. Oh, Tommy, you racist. Um, okay, Tommy, I got a question. How do you know when a joke is done? For me, a joke is only finished when ABC fires me from my self-titled show, Roseanne. <laughs> That's me personally. What about for you? Uh, when I smash the watermelon. <laughs> I'm absurd! <laughs> Maybe I should put all the things I don't know, man. Mm. Okay, Tommy, I got another question for you. On a scale of one to 10, mm -hmm. how do you like being a white guy? <laughs> That's the only way to be, brother. <laughs> um, you know, I think that we live in a in a complex world, and uh, you know, I was born this way, but all, all I can do is listen to everyone and try my best. <laughs> Uh, and that's when I smash the watermelon. <laughs> there we go. That's how you end up there. Okay. That's how you know when a joke is done. Uh, Tommy, uh, you have some musical elements in your comedy. Yeah, you Toby Keith. <laughs> <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't write this question. Okay. Tommy, you have some musical elements in your comedy. Have you ever thought about doing stand-up? <laughs> You know, that's a common misconception. A lot of people are kind of rude to musical comedy, but I think that you should just show your talents to the world. And um, I don't like this modern rap music, you know, what they're doing <laughs> with the baggy pants and all that. You know, pull those pants up. But rappers like who specifically do you not like? Like Eminem? Twix rappers. <laughs> there it is. That was impressive, Tommy. Goddamn.